Expect this Sunday. For a rundown of what you need to know, here's Fox 2's Vic Faust with Brown and Crouppen attorney Andrea McNary in the legal lens. Andrea, we have some new bills that passed in the state of Missouri that people may not know about uh, several of them. Where do you want to start with that? Sure, so several take effect on Sunday, everything from health to child custody, but I think some of the most interesting ones are voter ID, opioid treatment, and some changes to some school bus laws. So let's start with the voter ID. Um, starting Sunday, if you are going to vote in the state of Missouri, you're going to need a photo ID to cast a vote. Previously, you could use like a utility card or um, a paycheck, uh, anything that showed your name and address. Now you're going to have to have a driver's license or passport or state ID with an address, with a picture, and with an expiration date. What about opioid addiction treatment? So this is a really good development. So what it's going to allow the uh, Department of Health and Senior Services to do is issue a statewide order um, that basically allows pharmacists to sell and dispense uh, any opioid addiction treatment, medication, services, um, if there is a standing order. It's also going to allow the Missouri judiciary to have access to funds to help people um, with opioid addictions recover and seek treatment. We've talked about school buses recently. What about school bus changes? So if you have a child back to school, you know that the school buses are kind of a pinch point, not enough buses, not enough drivers. So the state has modified the definition of a school bus to include vehicles that carry more than 10 passengers. So this is gonna allow some school districts if they meet criteria to hire transportation companies or use other means to get children to school. Why are these starting in August now? Um, it's when they go into an effect. And, and if you want more information on uh, when bills become effective, you can go to uh, the website house.mo.gov. Vic Faust, Fox 2 News. You can catch The Legal Lens on Fox 2 every Wednesday at 6 p.m.